with one win away and a result going in our favour from lifting the title, which will be back-to-back titles for me as a manager. And we've just had our youth intake and we've got two very, very good prospects. Let's go check them out first. Hi guys, what are you here? Welcome back. This is episode 11 of the Sunday League 2 Premier League Journeyman Save. If you are enjoying this content, uh, please hit that subscribe button. It does mean a lot to me. I'm trying to get to 200 and you can make that happen. Uh, also, while you're there, hit that like button. It, uh, it does help uh, pushing the video out to more people and uh, chuck a comment to about these youth candidates. So, let's have a look at them first, I think, because they're right here. Now, um, when it came through before, it had five stars and excellent youth intake. Now it's below average. So, whatever. All right. But we've got two five star potential players here uh, Aaron Ellie Bremen. Bremen? Brian. Brian. He's a central midfielder. I can also fill in a left back, weirdly. Uh, he is one and a half stars at the moment, 16 years old with five star potential. And he, he doesn't look too bad. Good first touch, passing's a bit low, but these are these are quite high, almost to double digits. Good anticipation, concentration to like be 16. He's got good determination, fairly good, I guess, at 10. Um, he's got good work rate. He needs to work on that stamina, so he could be pretty good. I don't know, so um, not bad. And uh, Ulfa Haraldson, uh, he's, a, he's a striker, advanced forward, we like that. Uh, or, or a poacher, he's got good finishing. Good composure, great determination. He's actually pretty good. He could almost be good enough for the first team. Dribbling's quite low, he's anticipating decisions and off the ball. But hopefully they'll improve with his age. So they are really, really good. And he's 15. So with those coming through as well, I did say as well, if you wanted to get your name in the game, this is your chance. So if you want to comment, this is what you're going to comment about. Um, and uh, and let me know. If you want to grab one of these two here, or you know, we'll have a look at um I've all good Mundison as well down here. If you want me to change them to your name or a, another name, let me know in the comments and uh, and I can do that and we will we will follow their career. Let's have a look at old Ivor here. Um, he's a left-sided uh, winger. One star at the moment, three and a half stars. He's not as good. He's all right determination, flair, leadership. But he's, uh, yeah, he's probably not that good. But these two, they're looking pretty good. Everyone else is... is uh, we're not even going to bother looking at them because they are really, really ordinary. Um, but these two could definitely be something. They're off to go play their uh, their youth uh, youth game. So we'll, we'll see how they go with that. But since I left you, it was obviously that disastrous game against uh, Vestry where we got knocked out of the cup. Now, we didn't say I was going to come back around here and then, you know, maybe towards the end of the title. But I thought, what's the point coming back showing you a bit of a bleh game? Um, so I've left it now, and actually, we have a chance today against second place Val Hur. Now, if my maths is correct, and sometimes it isn't, I'll, I'll admit that. If we win today, we go to 44 points, okay? That is 13 points ahead of Val Hur with four games remaining. They cannot catch us. The problem is KA. They play these guys, who are pretty good, although they're sitting six on the title last year. Red and Billick, I think. Now... If KA beat them, then we'll have to go to to the uh, the next game, which will be against uh, bottom of the table, uh, for Flackler. Yeah, that guys. So it is close. We can actually win the title today with four games to spare. And as you can see, we haven't lost a game since um since I left you. Three two here over Viking. I want to say Viking. Is it Viking? It is Vikinger. Yep, another good crowd. That's at home. 3-2. It was a little bit touch and go there. They got two goals back. We can't take our foot off the pedal. Sajan in there. one all draw. That was disappointing. Um, I thought we could have done better over there. Three home games in a row. And look at that crowd. 3-1 win over rivals. Fram. That was nice. We then played KA away from home. And we dumped them 4-1. So they're a pretty big team, like I said. So that is that is good there. Uh, we then what, a nil all draw with IBV. Uh, a 1-0 win over Kef Levick. Okay, you can see here the home, well, it wasn't the home, but that was a home. You can see here then a 3-1 win over KR, 
and a 4 nil win over, there you go, Bray, Brayo Billick. I think that's it, I don't know, these names are so difficult. Um, but yeah, we looked really, really good there. Um, so yeah, that's all that happens. What I have been looking at actually is the um, the records for the Icelandic Premier Division. So um, most league wins in the season, 17. We can get 17 by winning our remaining five games. Um, biggest win we're not going to... Most w w matches, one in a row. I think, like I just said, we have to do... Uh, yeah, we've got three. We have to win the next one, two, three, four. Well, we've got to win the next five to uh, to beat that. Um, what else can we can we let's try and beat here? Most team goals, sixty one. That was on most points, I think. Where was that? Most points is fifty two, and most team goals is sixty one. So if we just throw this out, sixty two points was it? No, sixty two goals. 62 goals. I think we're we're a bit off that actually, to be honest. But 41 points though. I think we could quite easily get 11 more points from five games. So a couple of records there that we can break. Now you're probably thinking, how did I manage to do this to go from the you know for relegation candidates in my sort of first third of the season um, to winning the title to League Cup final and this. Now I was thinking about it as well. I don't actually think that the gap between the players, uh, the league still think we're gonna, the media still think we're gonna last, but I mean that's a change, but whatever. Um, the the difference in the players, I don't think is that is that great. The, the golf, sorry, the golf. I'm not the Premier Premier League and the Championship in England. The golf isn't actually that big. So we look at this guy here. He's like uh, in the media dream eleven to play up front. This guy here. I know we don't have all the attributes, but I, I mean, physically this guy's not very good, and I don't think he is going to be much better than we look at some of my players. Uh, and these guys are, you know, top quality. Look, this guy here, the right winger from KR, he's the best right winger in the game, apparently. I don't think he's much better than what we've got, to be honest. So, you know, I feel, you know, like, I mean, if his stats are at the absolute max upper, upper echelon here, then yeah, maybe, but they're not going to be. So, and that's what I think it is. I don't think that golf in class is is that much bigger, and that's why we've been able to do so well this season. And we could go for an undefeated season. I don't think I've really ever done that in any instance of football manager ever. I know this is 22 games, so it's a bit shorter, but amazing. Anyway, we should probably get into it, because I want to play two games this episode. Um, and I have a feeling I've come back a few days early. Yeah, I have, so... I'll just pull it soon after once we're clicking through a screen and uh, we'll go play the Valher game. See you then. All right, here we are, back for the Valher game. Now, um, this is probably the strongest team. Antonelli in goal, the right back, Mason, Salanovic, Salah, Soderberg. Um, we've got an injury to uh, Paul Halson, so Huxon. <laughs> his names. Huxon, 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 Huxon. He's been playing okay, so he's in there. Kakonen here. Mohamed, Engstrom, and uh, Palacios up front. Um, Corey Jordan haven't been playing super duper well, and he's got a little knock, so we're, we're going to leave him out of the team. Uh, I bench Pusaba, Wilson, N Wilson, Nilsson, <laughs> Saba, per Danny Bergson, who's got a bit of injury, um, Dino, and then uh, Jonsson. Cool, cool. This is it. This is an absolutely massive game for us. We had a team meeting as well, and uh, it went okay. It went okay. They, um, my assistant actually said to play up the importance, so I did, and everyone was happy apart from one person who I can't remember who it was. Yeah, I can't remember who it was. Just uh, a little bit different, a little bit different. Go in there and want someone the same. Look at that, all oh, yeah, there pumped apart from the right back. Probably can potentially become champion station. Everything for all the person that's in the best possible position. Uh, fellow coming in the place. Um, the usual standards. It's definitely a real awful guy. You can see the fixing and the fixing. That sounds good. 
What's just lose this game now? Look at that form. Win, draw, win, 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 win. That's all we do is win, win, win. And, uh, and Valher, their form is, uh, is, wow, really patching one win in five. As the teams come out to the pit, out to the pitch, onto the pitch, we're in our, uh, our bluey, bluey heel kick. Engstrom with a corner. Oh, Magnuson rising high as Armson collects. Look at this crowd. We get an absolutely stinking, stinkingly good crowd in. Uh, apologies again, guys. I'm still a little bit crook. Uh, nasally and all that kind of jazz bit correcting. So I do apologize for that. Hopefully it will be gone soon. It's Plastis on the ball now to Engstrom and Soderberg. Soderberg plays back to Magnuson. Magnuson using Engstrom. Engstrom out to the right back. He puts forward Plastis now. Plastis is through. And Danny Plastis. Get in. We also need results to go away. But let's not forget that. It is. Whoa. Well, we needed these guys to win. These four, three. Is that the game over? I don't know. Anyway, it's a corner. It's Engstrom in the corner. Whips it in. Magnuson's up at top. That is just over. He is so good. Now. That near post corner thing is ridiculous. I think it's had to be a draw minimum because that 11 points, four games. Can't quite do it. But I don't, I'm not sure if this game's over or, or a late kickoff or. I mean, it must have been. This game must be over. So that's kind of rained on our parade already. But, you know, we've got a win. A long throw there, headed by Muhammad, straight to the goalkeeper. And it's all us. All us at the moment. Yeah, shout out a bit of encouragement to them. Here's Magnus, similar to the ball. Soderberg, the right back. Engstrom, I should just change the name to the right back. And we've lost possession here, giving it to Valhur. Let's not. Give up a cheap goal before half time. Oh, but Halkson there. He flicks the ball over to Kakonen. This thing would just. Oh! <laughs> Hamid Salah. He's on the record for most of six as well. He's got seven. That's now eight in the league. And I think the record is 11. Yes, one play for set pieces. Look at this. Bosh. It is so overpowered, but good. I'm enjoying it. Antonelli had a bit of a, uh, a rocky start to his his career um, here. He finally sort of settled a bit recently, though. He's got us 40 goals now. In four games, we did score up an absolute buttload to um, um, keep working hard. This rival, I didn't realise. This was a, a rivalry game. I mean, I guess it is, sort of, because they're trying to get us to the title. I mean, they're, they're out of it now. They're going to the KA if they can get back, but we're going to have to grab a win next game. To, uh, that's, I mean, we're still in this game. It's half time. Would you slow down a bit, mate? You're getting a little bit over excited as uh, they have uh, headed over the bar. Probably look to make a couple of changes soon. Conan and Mohammed are not playing that well. Uh, and they look to be getting a little bit tired. I don't care about yellow cards. What I do care about is players getting tired. Um what is it? don't really yeah. We bring Dino on and we are going to bring on, I don't think I've got anyone who can play behind the striker. I don't think Soderberg can, sort of can. Um, let's bring Sama on to Mohamed, push Soderberg out. I could go more defensive actually, couldn't I? And drop in to the DM role. Ah, we'll leave it like that. Um, and we'll bring Daddy on as well. Point the finger. Oh, make me proud. Make me proud, boys. We can't win the league because what's his, these guys, KA, will end up hardy. But I have a feeling the next game against bottom of the league is at home. So hopefully, fingers crossed, we don't slip up here. And uh, and that one goes. We don't really need a point in there because that would leave but four games left. Yeah, we, I think that's points, maybe. And then he's Valher with the ball now, looking to 
repair gets back here, but a wayward shot goes zipping past it. The girls and uh, Antonelli just watches it go past. We're um, set that one there. Confirm the change. It's sort of take our foot off the pedal here. I can't see them getting back into this with two goals. This is what I did that other game when we were three 0 up, and they scored two goals quickly. So we'll uh, we'll see what happens here. I probably shouldn't underestimate these guys, but um, we're all over them at the moment. Antonelli booting them on that field. Um, but we can't gather it as a Valher now on the ball. They are really, really trying here to do something, but they're just really having a lot of shots in range, which is good. I guess we're stopping them from getting into those scoring positions. Um, but that is an absolute cracker of a shot, and, uh, and we're going to go back to that. It's all right, we're getting a little bit tired. It's fine. We can do it. Let's. Uh, I stuck some time wasting in there now. We've probably got what's left on the clock to time waste. We should see this one out, and we do two nil winners. But I thought it's four. Did you see that? Because they scored. Okay. We won. That's what we want. So now that is excellent. We're not quite champions yet. Not quite champions yet. There you go. Oh my god, it was so long between games. So long between games. Have a look here. I, I, I've done this before. I don't notice the schedule gap. So 27th of the 8th, we played that game. 17th of the 9th, like three weeks later, we played a friendly in the middle there just to keep everyone's fitness up. So don't, you know, read too much into that. But we're getting lots and lots of new stuff coming through, um, saying, you know, we had a team meeting that went pretty good. So here we are. Um, Premier Division title hall. We keep going like points, number of wins. Oh, it's exciting. Very exciting stuff. Uh, just so you know as well, guys, I have completed two coaching courses while I've been in Iceland. I now have my national A license. Thank you very much. Uh, reputation is 20%. So uh, starting to look pretty good there and these stats have jumped up quite considerably as well these I should have put them down but level this one 14 motivating nine uh, these tactical technical these ones are going up as well with that ability one good stuff right let's get into the game this is absolutely massive i think a win let me draw so that's him we go 45 and they go to 36 that is nine points in three games so we can't have that we have to win or k uh -huh. beat KA. I don't think we can relegate these guys to either because even if Kefalovic that that name they win next summer with 15 and it's still nine points so they really do cut them adrift. Unchanged team, the only change is Corey Jordan in for Nielsen who is injured and um that's it. That's it. Let's go. That's exciting. So exciting. <laughs> As I said in the intro, back-to-back -back titles, back-to-back -back titles in different divisions. <laughs> um, let's keep that going, that's good, let's get into it, here we go. Uh, seat behind a good way for it, so down hard work. The problem is going to be a good way work, once confidence wants to engage there. Uh... Okay, yep, that's only good. Right, here we go. I thought we were at home. We're not at home. We should be scheduled better. But anyway, cool. It's a buzzing, buzzing, buzzing. This is it. This is the title. The roar is not quite enough. I mean, we will do it on gold if it's so big. So, two games could turn into quite a long episode. But, um, if we, if we stuff this up, Hopefully you know. Right, it is Flicklier. Fly, fly, lick, yeah. Fly, kit, fly, kit. I, I'm going to leave Iceland with never being able to pronounce any of these teams' names properly and uh, butchering the players' names 50% um, of the time as well. Mohamed Nelwin on the ball back to Soderberg. Soderberg, that's a good ball to Plasius. Plasius! Straight at the goalkeeper. Is there a goalkeeper called Simple? 
It's simple. Instrum, instrum. Oh, Magnuson, is it the crossbar? What is it? Come here. Where's name? Where's his name? Sample. His name is Sample. He's a sample of the goalkeeper. Ho, ho, ho. Funny stuff. Now, first half's gone pretty quick. We should, judging by last year, probably nail the goal. Um, but they don't look like they're doing too much. Um, that one worked pretty well. So, what was the game we were looking at? Oh, this one here, they're drawing. We need to win. We need to win. We're going to throw them. We're going to chuck it out there. Very attacking. They tell the boys we want more. He's Engstrom to the corner. <gasps> ah, that's it. I thought that was in. I did think that was in. He's the, the right back with his long throw. There's another one. And we lose the ball. This is where we're vulnerable on the counter here. But we've got players back. We turn it. No. Their attack kind of folded. And he's allowed. He's been disallowed. What we get for going very attacking. What the changes. Uh, Muhammad not playing well. Um, I mean, Dino on for him. Um, let's put Dino out to the win. Um, Hudson is nervous, so we'll get him off. Wilson Saba. We'll just do that. Put your finger, thank you, you go make the difference, boys. Oh, like, come on, this is it. One goal. One goal. KR winning. That, that, that's actually enough for us to win the league at this point, drawing your all. So, Common Salah is tired. Come on, boys. Oh, I've pegged it back. The draw is still Valhara up, but that's 11 points in three games. I think with this wins us the title if we draw here. We probably should have won this game, but sample goalkeeper. Is that a title? It is. It is. Oh, so what a day. What a day. We did it with a nil or draw against the bottom of the table. That's football, hey? That is football. Boys are happy. There's me in my purple suit. I don't know why it's purple. It should be black. Look at that. There it is. And the confetti comes down and they've all got to pick it up on their crowd. On their on their ground, away from home. And we'll have the obligatory cartwheel in a minute. It looks like it's going to be number nine doing it. Is that Plasios, the number nine? No, it's the number five. I've been hoodwinked there. Ah, breathe it in, boys. This is it. Double double titles, essentially. Magnuson was just a look at the back again. I mean, we, we dominated the game. We probably should have won, and we've, we've done it. We've, we've fallen over the finish line, essentially. I'm not going to sympathise. Sympathise. I'm going to congratulate them. We're champions. Like, we've done it. Amazing feat and achievement. Congratulations. It's always nice to win trophies. Um, so, business. Uh, comment on individuals. These guys are going to be pumped. I actually love Woody Woodington. <laughs> And we've won the title. There we go. We've qualified for the Champions League as well. Oh my god, heady stuff. Heady, heady stuff. I'm going to it's fine. Initial budget. Oh, budget of zero, but that wage budget is good because I am financially crippling this club. I've lost half a million in squid since we've been in here. Top Australian manager. Ecstatic. Everyone's happy. He was just amazing. Perilous in the air, I would say. Right, let's go and have a look at me before we go. Right, so oh, a little bit more of a reputation here. I'm nominal now. Actually, this has gone up slightly 25% now. Right. So, go and have a look at the job center, right? Oh, wow, not a lot here that sort of stands out. Job security wise, we'll see if anyone's jobs under threat. Look at this, I'm on the league and like let's go let's go check out the other jobs, boys. There's not really a lot. Actually, is there some very insecure ones here, Polish first division, but hmm. Stream Premier Division. Hmm. 
got some championship ones. I've, I've, I've thrown England in here now. I opened that up. Um, just in case. But yeah, well, anyway, John's wife will have to see that. Anyway, guys, we've won this final. It's been absolutely amazing. I'm going to use the last couple. Oh, we obviously lost a few things. Yeah, we couldn't get those seven wins in a row. I don't think we can get the most amount of points. Anyway, we've got three games left, guys. I'm going to play them off camera. We've we've won the league. It's been amazing. Back-to-back -back titles. We've bought the first ever Icelandic Premier Division title to uh, Rick Reykjavik here for Potter. Absolutely it's outstanding. Um, I know I've said this at the end of every season so far in this save, but I probably won't be at Iceland next season. Watch me, I probably will. Anyway, guys, I hope you've enjoyed that. If you have, hit that subscribe button. Uh, smash that like button. You never, you, you always got to smash it and um, and put a comment in there as well. Let me know about those youth players, the names in the game. Let me know if you've got any now. Go back to the beginning, watch the video again.